And the path to recovery following the Marshall Fire, it doesn't look the same for all people. Yeah, some are rebuilding, others are still sifting through rubble. And for one bolder musician who lost it all, he wasn't even sure where he could begin. He wasn't. Luckily, Denver 7 Gives and our generous viewers have stepped up to help. Music is always with me all throughout the day and really all throughout the night. Wyatt Russell has always created his own tempo in life and told Mother Nature forcefully picked up the pace. Been trying to approach it from a glass half full standpoint, thinking maybe everything's not gone. But everything was gone, including his entire home and belongings. And Russell spoke to Denver 7 in the chaos of it all. Just completely blown away. Even now, nearly four months later, the shock of the Marshall Fire remains. That fire was just so fast and so intense and I'm just I'm just really grateful that I got out of there when I did um, because if I had stayed maybe 10 or 15 minutes more I don't think I would have I would have had to run out but he made it out with the most precious thing his life and it's why he's sitting here with us today but like others he mourns some of the things he lost records drums recording equipment um, you know symbols that aren't made anymore snare drums that aren't made anymore for the lifelong Coloradan and musician who used to do small gigs as extra income, the losses have been tough. But thanks to the generosity of Denver 7 viewers, a new drum kit and a new chance to bring in extra earnings arrived to Wyatt's home. The Mapex drum kit, just what he needed to play and record music. It's, it's, I'm, I'm so grateful. And the kindness of complete strangers now reminds him of one thing. There's a ton, there's a ton of good people left. Um, giving people, caring people, compassionate people, and I am grateful for those people, um, so thankful. There are good people who have set his life back to its usual tempo. In Boulder County, I'm CB Cotton, Denver 7.